This weekend marks the 13th anniversary of the June 1st tornado. 22 News Storm Team meteorologist Adam Stremko is working for you with how common tornadoes are here in western Massachusetts. Well, Brian, we've seen some severe weather this spring, but the worst weather has been over the southern and central part of the country where they've seen several tornado outbreaks. When thunderstorms become severe, they are capable of producing tornadoes. On average, three to five tornadoes touch down in Massachusetts each year. Typically, you know, the tornadoes here are not as strong or, you know, as a, a long duration events as what we see out west because of, you know, the flatter land that they have out there. Tornado, tornadoes don't like, you know, hilly terrain. So uh, usually if we're going to see a spin up or so, it tends to happen more towards the valley areas. One of the biggest tornadoes in recent memory, of course, was the June 1st tornado in 2011. That tornado was an EF3 with winds estimated at 160 miles per hour. It left a path of destruction 39 miles long from Westfield to Charlton. Three people died as a direct result of the tornado and 200 people were injured. Even though the June 1st tornado was one of the most devastating, there have been other tornadoes that have touched down here in western Massachusetts this time of year. Back in 1995, on May 29th, Memorial Day, another deadly tornado touched down in the Berkshires. The Great Barrington tornado was an F4 with winds estimated at 260 miles per hour. It leveled the Great Barrington Fairgrounds and killed three people, two students and a faculty member from the Eagleton School. In July 2006, an F2 tornado with wind speeds up to 155 miles per hour touched down in the Franklin County town of Wendell. That tornado left a four-mile path of destruction and damaged about a dozen homes. Now, the deadliest tornado to ever hit New England was the Worcester tor tornado on June 9th of 1953. That killed 94 people and injured over 1,200 people. Working for you live in Chicopee, I'm 22 News Storm Team Meteorologist Adam Stremko.